Hi, this is Terry with Sweet Stitch and Embroidery and Design. I've had several people ask me about using the basting stitch. I'm doing a short, quick video to show you how to do that. And again, thanks for stopping by. I've got a design open on the screen, just a applique letter I. You want to go up to Tools, which is on the menu bar. That's the menu bar. Select Tools and Basting Stitch. And I generally like to do based around pattern. When it says based around pattern, it uh, puts the base stitch just immediately around the outside of your design. And uh, you can also add lock stitches for bobbin pickup if you're having problems with the basting stitch uh, stitching around. But usually the, the only time you'll have problems is if you make your stitches too long. I try to keep my basting stitch stitches at around six. Uh, four is the default, but I try six, and that usually works out fine. And I don't have the lock stitches selected. And if you select this one instead, based, based around inside of hoop, what that does is, if you've got your hoop, uh, if you got your hoop all uh, stabilized and getting ready to stitch, the basting stitch will first stitch around the inside of your hoop just inside the edge, as close to the outside edge as it can go. And that's good a lot of times if you're going to be adding something else or adding some more text, if you're doing a couple of hoopings. Uh, but anyway, that's all there is to it. And then just click OK, and you're all set. Thanks for stopping by, and have a great day.